Hello, I am Professor Stephen Abbott. Welcome to another resource for adhesion science, this time on polymer molecular weights. Molecular weight is very important to understand for an adhesive, and it's not quite as simple as we would like. I use this spreadsheet to show what's going on. A typical polymer is not a single molecular weight. It has a distribution, something like the one shown here, where it goes up with a high low molecular weight peak and then has a high molecular weight peak here. And we can set up this distribution. I can change the height of that peak. I can make it wider. And I can also change its position. And from this, we calculate the number average molecular weight, Mn, which emphasizes the lower molecular weight aspect. There's the weight average, Mw, which multiplies this curve by the molecular weight and therefore skews everything in the high molecular weight end. And then there's Mv, which is the viscosity molecular weight, which is generally in between the two. And then there's the polydispersity, Mw over Mn, which shows how far it differs from a pure polymer. So you might get the same polymer with an MN of 73,000 from two different suppliers, but if their MWs are different, if their polydispersities are different, then they will behave as very different polymers. So you can play around with that at this point. There's another one which is all about critical entanglement molecular weight, which is absolutely vital for understanding adhesion. And one of the characteristics, if you take a polymer and increase its molecular weight and measure its melt viscosity, then as you increase the molecular weight, the melt viscosity goes up, not surprisingly. But at a critical point, it suddenly goes up much faster. And that critical point is the critical entanglement molecular weight. If I change that from 10,000 to 20,000, you'll see that the curve changes. And this critical entanglement molecular weight is when the chains start getting properly tangled like a ball of wool, and then they offer much more resistance and much higher viscosity. Feel free to download this little helper spreadsheet with its two workbooks. It's all free of charge.